My name is Edouard Ndeki, and I'm from Senegal. 95% of people where I grow up are not Christian. But from all of that population, God picked my dad to be a pastor. Growing up was not easy seeing your friends going to school. We have to stay at home because my parents didn't have money to send us at school. I was so upset because all my friends have everything they want. When I say, Dad, why we are not blessed like them? And he said, even if you don't eat, even if you don't have stuff, Edward, remember that you have God. I was involved in the group Good News Club. That Wednesday was amazing. We were coming to have fun, to laugh, to joke, to do all of that. And uh, we received a box. We opened it. In the side of the box was toothbrush. I didn't have to brush when I was growing up. We used charcoals and salt to brush our teeth. Having it for the first time was just a miracle. This is the wow. It was wrapped like this. I didn't know what is inside. Carefully, this is my yo-yo. This is my yo-yo. Every day, every night, with the neighborhood, we always play. Someone cares. God, He cares so much. He has to use someone somewhere around the world to pack my box. I came to United States because of my background being a track athlete. I was involved in the church in my local town. And one time, I saw the boxes I received when I was 14. And I was so excited. I didn't have words. I was just like, what is, what is this? Where did this come from? Is reality here, people? Is you guys are doing this for real? And they say, yes. I say, I received one when I was 14. And everybody was so happy. Everybody was looking at me like, yes, you are in our church. Seeing God connecting me being 14 and coming to United States and to see the two elements just connected as a perfect picture, show me that I'm in the right spot. I'm in the right place serving the Lord. Daniel is my son. Daniel is the version of Edward in Senegal, but in the United States. Talking to him is the opportunity like my dad told me. No matter what you struggle with, remember, you have a God that loves you. Daniel packed boxes, and he liked to say also his dad received one. In the corner of this universe, you have a kid that is waiting for you to pack a box for them. It's not just a shoe box that you are packing. You are changing lives.